All right. So before I come to my own case, make I quickly talk about the honorable member where slap Uber driver. Finally, justice has been served. They don't charge and go court and they don't remand them for prison. Even though you no go stay there, at least in go test the place where people will commit crime. They stay in go no say it's not better than anybody. He himself don't test Kiri Kiri and it will be there. Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to this Facebook page and YouTube channel. Guys, wonder shall never end. FCT Command has invited VDN because of the uniform, po police uniform he wore on his kit he did the last time. Guys, I will play you guys the video of VDN, hear what he said on this video. And at the same time, play you guys after he threw from the FCT Command what they told him, everything. You know, he said, according to VDN, he said he never knew that police, you need permission from them before you use their uniform. I will play you guys that video. And we're going to discuss about Alice. Bro, do you guys know that Senator Alice was arrested today as they went to court today? Yes. I'm so excited that one of the senators was arrested today. But according to the story, George told him to pay himself with 500,000 naira, of which he had the money and he did. Let's go straight out to this news. First, let me play you guys video of VDN when he was going to FCT command to, you know, attend to the invitation he got from them. So I'll play you guys the video. I'll still play you guys his video after he round up from that place. I'll play you guys the video. Just take your time. Listen to VDN. They'll come back to put our own take. Please, I'll beg you, share this video, please. Watch, they'll come back. All right, um, so I'm waiting on my lawyer. Um, I'm on my way. We are on our way to the FCT command. Two days ago, the FCT command invited me on the allegation that I used police uniform to shoot my video. Um, I'm just going there to clear my name um, to let them know what's up. You understand? I know a lot of you will be surprised. Ah, why BDM we wear suits? You don't understand? Only be every day we wear singlets. I guess sometimes when we say we go there on some officials, you know the vibe. So then wait for my lawyer to come. Eh? Just standing here waiting. This cool street, people looking at me, spit and clean, you know. <laughs> Don't play. Where she did now? Anyways, we wait to get. Don't play, but he's playing. You know, VDM is one person, you know. I like this guy so much. You know why? Because this guy is straightforward. But this one that the FCT command I invited in to come to their office just because of the uniform he wore to shoot in skates. Bro, this is crazy. Anyway, let me play you guys the other video of VDM. Hear what VDM said they told him in the FCT command when he got there. Let me play you guys this video. Please share the video. All right, so I'm back from the police station. It was back and forth, back and forth. Um, they brought me in based on the post that I made where I said I was a CSP of the online division. Um, so a lot of discussion happened, interrogation, and I found out some things. You know, we learn every day. Now, first of all, me, I made my video and I said CSP, me, my own interpretation. What I meant was chief social media person. However, the Nigerian police have a rank called CSP, which means Chief Superintendent of Police. And also, they said the uniform I was wearing is similar to the Nigerian police. That if at all you want to use a v uh, uniform that is similar to that of the Nigerian police, you have to seek permission, which I didn't know all these. You understand? So, um, it's looked as if I was caricaturing the Nigerian police, which was never my intention. So, I want to make a formal apology to the Nigerian police. Of course, I cannot caricature you without you. Who is going to protect us, you know? And of course, if I caricature now, I won't do cases for me because I bring a lot of cases for you guys based on the people that are being scammed online. And as you all know, I promote social and moral uprightness in the society. So apologies to the Nigerian police if they are offended by my video. Furthermore, to anybody that wants to use anything that's associated with the police that looks like the police, because now I find out, say, even though no be police, they like to pass it resemble police some way, some way that still police, you must take permission from them because some people can actually use that kind of thing can go wrong. Do you understand? Some people feel can use and go wrong claiming police impersonation. 
and other things. However, in my own video, I just made it and that was it, you know. So I've submitted the uniform I used to the police and then everything. I don't know where we'll move on from here, but apologies to the Nigerian police. And like I said, if you want to use anything police, go meet police. So may they give you clarity, all these content creators and every other person so that you know going enter this and may they go invite you, you understand? So if you want to use the police, anything I should have the police, listen. Make sure so you go seek permission or else you're going to learn and you're going to learn the hard way. So shout out to the Nigerian police as usual and they bring more kids to now. Peace and love. Don't play. Okay, guys, you heard from VDM. You heard everything he said. Ah, <laughs> anyways, VDM, you did the right thing. You know, you did the right thing. No doubt, you did the right thing, you know, for apologizing. For telling them you made a mistake, no problem. But my own take on this issue is Nigeria police. I want to ask a question: Is it only VDM that has been using the Nigeria police uniform to shoot kids in Nigeria? Why is VDM case different? What about other people that is still shooting kids with Nigeria police uniform? Why have you guys not invited those people to your office? Why is VDM case different? Oh, now person will not go feel beats. Oh, because VDM is popular. That's why you guys did that to him. And you guys now collect the uniform from him. Those movies that we are watching online, all those things that we are watching online. Oh, okay, those ones, they reach out to you guys before they started using it. Nigerian police, who not stop, who oh. not stop, because this is this is this is oppression, like I would say, because what you guys are trying to say is uh, that we use it to go and rob it. Nigerian police, even your own people, your own people, they just rob with this uniform. Yes, go to social media today, you will see your policemen. They will drink and misbehave, be fighting with the uniform. What have you guys done to those people? Oh, because VDN is famous. They got to, you know, attend to him this way. Hmm. Okay, well, no problem. Since the guy don't say, okay, he did sorry, no, no. When I let him slide now. So, guys, let's go to the other news about Senator Alice that went to court today and they arrested him. See, what happened to that man? I'm so excited because in he need to test where Nigerians like where they put all these innocent some innocent Nigerian people. He need to test there. They took him there today, like they took him to Kuje prison. He has to bear himself with five hundred thousand naira today. That's what the judge said. He must bear himself with five hundred thousand. Anyways, let me play you guys the video here from VDM. Hear from VDM, they will come back. Please share this video. They just watch and go. Share this video, please. All right. So before I come to my own case, make I quickly talk about the honorable member where slap Uber driver. Finally, justice has been served. They don't charge and go court and they don't remand them for prison. Even though you no go stay there, at least in go test the place where people will commit crime. They stay in go no say it's not better than anybody. He himself don't test kiri kiri and it will be there. Do you understand? We should not be in a community where people can abuse people anyhow they lie because they are big men. Where there's no crime, there's no law. Because we have law, there's a crime and he committed a crime. And then to portable, we also do the same thing. Because just the way this man I saw that Uber driver, and I saw portable Molala me, and I saw him take beats person up which day. And so people they, they ginger him. It is wrong. It don't run go Canada now, but I believe that the Nigerian police are actually going to make justice to take its cause. So I will encourage you people that Mona know they take law into my hands. You understand? So I'm gonna come back for my own turn. Make I tell now what happened for dear. Peace and love. Don't play. Yes, that was what happened today. Although I just played his own for you guys. You guys heard about what happened to him there. But the issue is. Senator Alex was arrested. See, that's the that's the perfect one that they did today, because nobody is bigger than the law. 
You know, the senator wanted to brag. Yeah, yeah, all these, yeah. Oh, they put off a body letter and say, bro, you're not supposed to assault that guy like that. You're not supposed. Even though you be senator, you be, see, you must chop it. It's a crime you did. And you must pay for it. And they took him to Kujay prison. Although he didn't sleep there, but at least you go there, go feel land. That's the most important thing. You went there, you felt it. And you have to bail yourself with 500,000 naira. 500k naira to bail himself. Mind you, you are going to pay that guy, the bus driver. You are going to pay him for what you did to him. Have it at the back of mind. You are going to pay him. So this is what we need in Nigeria. The law needs to be working. All these politicians, all these people don't need to go away with, you know, any crime they commit in Nigeria. They don't need to go away with it. They have to pay for their crime. But I'm so excited that this guy, Alice, paid for his own. He paid for his own. And that was nice. I love it. See, let me end this video. VDM, God will bless you. Try then. See, this guy, they try for Nigeria. This guy, they try. They come pay me say Nigeria police. Now, I'm going to take advantage because say, we are now uniform. Now, you're just going to take the advantage. Say, blah, blah. No. Anyway, it's not a uniform. Now, the world at one time. But the guy said, okay. The meaning of that CSP was chief social media person. Now, he be chief social media personnel. Now, he be. You know, the reason I go, we are not the reason that they go. But since you guys are telling him to drop the uniform, are you guys see the uniform? Okay. But you guys should go and tackle those people who are putting on your uniform, fighting on the street like a policeman. Tackle those people. Guys, I will hand this video coming coming Please let me to share this video as you do so. God bless you. See you guys on my next video. Stay safe, guys, and bye-bye.